guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a video all about dum 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 coconut oil. Mine is currently melted because it is 43 degrees, which is I believe about 115 degrees Fahrenheit. So, so that's why it looks like this, but usually is quite a solid. So today I decided to do a whole video solely around the 10 top beauty uses for coconut oil. I thought this would be really cool and informative to people who have not really used coconut oil for many things. Coconut oil has definitely become very popular over the past year or so. A lot of people have been using it for their hair, their nails. Um, ingesting it, using it for their skin and um, curing their skin conditions. So I thought I would let you guys in on a few little beauty tips. Just a quick tip if you are going to purchase this, make sure you get it unrefined as it's not going to have additives and it's going to be completely natural which is essentially what you want. So let's get started. Tip number one. Coconut oil is absolutely amazing for your skin. It is traditionally known for its anti-aging properties which is like Hallelujah. You can add a grainy substance or a salt to it to make it into a body scrub. You can use it on your legs and your bum to reduce cellulite and stretch marks. You can use it on your cracked heels and lips. And you can also add it into a bath and just soak in that goodness. Tip number two, it is also an amazing maker remover. This tip was like my favorite because I had no idea and my skin does get a little bit irritated by wipes. So using a little bit of this on a cotton pad and swiping that over your face just removes your makeup instantly and leaves your skin feeling amazing. Also really safe to put on your eyes and get rid of your mascara and eyeshadows. Um, if it does get in your eyes, it's not going to hurt them at all. You just go a little bit blurry for a few seconds. Tip number three, it's amazing for people who have skin disorders. So if you have psoriasis, eczema, acne. Make sure you check with your doctor or dermatologist first, but a lot of people do use this little baby to cure up their skin conditions and I know firsthand my brother and partner both get like um, rashes on their face. Both have skin conditions and it has cured them up so amazingly. Um, it's also great if you do have irritated skin just to soothe it. Just make sure you check with your doctor first because obviously I'm not a dermatologist or a doctor so I cannot recommend it, but at the same time I'm just giving you a tip that you should go ask your dermatologist if you can use it. <laughs> Tip number four, it is a fantastic hair moisturizer, conditioner, and mask. What I like to do and how I grew my hair super duper long like Rapunzel is that I put this in my hair for a good two hours or I sleep with it in my hair overnight. So I smother it in my hair and I wear a towel over my head when I go to sleep. Then when I wake up in the morning, I get in the shower and I shampoo it at least three times just because it is oil. So it's gonna be really stuck in there. So make sure you shampoo it three times and then your hair is going to be so smooth, so shiny, so mmm. It also is known for stimulating hair growth. So I think that's why my hair is like a weed. And another little tip is that you can also put it on your hands and smooth down your flyaways. And also on that hair tip, if you put it in your eyebrows and eyelashes, it will help them grow and thicken. Number five is that it is a great massage oil. So not only are you getting a free massage from someone, but it's also going to thoroughly moisturize your skin and prevent aging and all that good stuff. Number six is a great cuticle oil. So if you are in the Northern Hemisphere, then you're coming into winter. And if you're like me, your cuticles are gonna crack. They might even bleed. So if you moisturize your cuticles with coconut oil, they're gonna be a-okay. Number seven oil pulling and this is something that I'm just amazed by. I try this out and it works. So oil pulling is when you take a good amount of coconut oil on a tablespoon and put it in your mouth and swish it around for about 20 minutes or as long as you can. Um, it's going to feel a bit gross in your mouth but it's something that you know it's nothing that's disgusting at all. So what that's going to do is detoxify your teeth and gums. Cut through the plaque and remove all the bacteria and essentially leave your mouth so much healthier than what it was before. Also can reduce sensitivity and my favorite part of this is that it whitens your teeth. So this is a very very cheap alternative to teeth whitening. I know firsthand that teeth whitening can cost a bazillion dollars especially if you're just buying the kits. Oh, I don't know why they're so expensive. It drives me absolutely insane. So this is my holy grail. This is why my teeth are a lot whiter than what they used to be because I love drinking coke and you drink coke you can't have white teeth. <laughs> Number eight is that it is a fantastic homemade sunscreen. This is something that I do not condone at all. 
but if you are someone who likes to go in the sun and sun bake and use an oil I would highly recommend changing over to this because it does have a very small SPF factor to it and I just feel like if you're gonna use anything use this even though you shouldn't be doing at all I think the SPF factor is only like five or something but it's better than using absolutely nothing and cooking yourself in baby oil or something ridiculous like that it just makes me cringe I think it's just because I'm so pale the thought of going in the sun is like pretty much like I'm a meter away from the sun it's just like zzzz. number nine I thought I would include some kind of weirder interesting tips so for all my fellow ladies out there I know that you've probably mostly all experienced this and coconut oil can actually help fight UTIs externally and internally I'm not sure how the externally part works do ingest a tablespoon or so a day it's going to really help um, reduce the risk of getting it I guess. It also naturally clears up cold sores so if you are someone who is prone to getting cold sores which I think is a very large amount of people and it can also get rid of head lice. <laughs> so I think we just need to grab about 5,000 litres of this stuff and just dump it over all the primary schools. So if you are a parent and your kid gets head lice, this is another cheap, um, toxic free, non-stinking alternative you can try. At the same time, you're not going to be damaging your child's hair, it's going to be actually benefiting it. And number 10! And the last tip I thought I would tell you guys about how um, ingesting it can give you so many internal benefits. It can increase your mental health, it can aid sleeping, sore throats, and help aid weight loss and if you do have cuts and bruises and all that sort of stuff it does have um, anti-inflammatory and antibacterial properties so it can heal all that up. This is such a universal fantastic oil. It helps your hair, your nails, your your body, your skin. So if you do want a very universal product, I would definitely recommend this. It's going to make your eyelashes grow, it's going to whiten your teeth, it's going to make your hair grow, it's going to make your skin clear. I mean, what more do you really want in a product? And it's also very, very cheap. If you are interested in buying coconut oil, make sure you do get the unrefined version and you can find it in the cooking aisle of most grocery stores. Looks like I'm naked. Thank you guys so much for watching this tip video. I hope you did enjoy it. I have not done one of these before. And if you did enjoy it, please give it a big thumbs up so I know to do more like this next time. And leave me a comment telling me a few of your tips to use coconut oil because I would love to know if there's any more things I can do with it. Also subscribe if you're not already because it means the world to me and you can just join my YouTube family. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!